What about the the lingo? Right. What are some terms or some phrases one might hear in the city of Tampa right about now? You might hear breasts. You know, breasts mean like, you know how niggas be like, bro. And you know what I'm saying, Brody. They might, whatever they say, Brody, bruh. You know what I'm saying? We be like, bruh. They might say, bruh. We say, bruh, too. That's a Florida slang. But breasts, breasts is something that we say. Breasts is like, like you my breasts. You know what I'm saying? You my nigga. You know what I'm saying? When you come in town, I be like, shit, breasts coming in town. They be like, ooh, I be like, smalls, nigga. We got to treat smalls like royalty. That's breasts. That you my nigga. You feel me? Breasts. Um, shit, we be like, like, we be saying shit like, like that. Oh, I'm like that. I'm like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bitch, I'm to the fullest, of, uh, the fullest extent of what you could think of, nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm all the way up there with it. I'm like that. You know what I'm saying? Um, shit, what else, what else what we be saying? We be saying all kind of shit, man. Capping. Oh yeah, let's get this in. Hold on, let's get this in the in the open, bro. Capping, bitch. We started that shit like I don't know. I really don't know where the niggas think that shit came from or where the niggas. It ain't no shade to nobody, but in Tampa, Florida, my nigga, I got a song way back in 2004 that say stop capping, bro. Like real nigga shit, we been saying capping for a long time, dog. So what these niggas be doing is like. You know what I'm saying? They be having niggas from Tampa around them and shit, and they be and we be saying yes, sir, and all that. Ain't no shade to nobody. I'm just saying this shit that we started. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of shit. Tampa really known for a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? That was the song title in 2004 to the uh, to the song you mentioned, capping in. Yeah, capping, capping. That's what you know. what I'm saying that that that's basically like flagging. That's like. You lying, nigga. Like, know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't got a lot of kicking. This nigga do a lot of capping. This nigga do a lot of fronting. Fronting. You know, in New York, they say fronting and shit. You ain't got a front, nigga. We be like, nigga, you ain't got a cap. You know what I'm saying? Same shit. But but the name of that song, when you said it in 2004, what was the title of that song? It was called Capping. Oh, it was actually called Capping. Yeah, real shit. Oh. Matter of fact, I'm going to send it to you so we can run this through the interview and shit, like a little piece of it or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> you said that back in 2004. In 2004. And they were saying it before the end, but I just had them been a young nigga coming up knowing that what the lingo was and put a song together about it. You feel me? Any other phrases? Man, shit, we got so many motherfucking phrases, bro. Can't think of them off the top of my head. But you know, Florida, just Florida, just Florida. Do they say, do they use the word jit in Tampa? Yeah, jit. That's, yeah, definitely jit. That's, that's a kid. That's a young nigga. So, you know, you got the older niggas, the OGs and shit. They be like, come here, Jit. Jit, go to the store for me. Man, y'all just tighten up. Y'all just tripping. Y'all disrespecting people and shit. Y'all just, you know what I'm saying? Just tighten up with that shit though, man. Tighten up. You feel me? Do you know the history behind that word, where that actually, that particular phrase originated at? Yeah, it come from your grandma and them. You know what I'm saying? Huh. When your grandma used to be like, oh, man, them jitterbugs. Jitterbugs. You know, jitterbugs is kids that just can't sit still. Jitterbugs. So then it went from jitterbugs to jits. Come here, Jit. And you don't say jitterbug no more. You know what I'm saying? You know, every generation just shorten words and shit. You know what I'm saying? So it ain't it ain't it ain't jitterbug no more, it's jit. Mm -hmm. So then it turned into a hood slang, a ghetto slang to like where it just meant young nigga, young motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? But but is it a particular city that particular word came from? It came from Tampa. Jit I, came from Tampa. I would say jit came from I say jit came from Florida. Cause I really don't know. Cause Miami talk the same way we talk in some uh, instances. Uh, Jacksonville, the whole Florida, we talk the same way sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So I really couldn't tell you where it come from, but I know definitely it's a Florida slang.